WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrial trading down 96, Nasdaq's off 13, S&P's off 4.5. Gold, gold contract down $19.40, trading at 1954 an ounce. We have silver up 2 cents, $22.61 an ounce. Light sweet crude off a buck, $89, $75.48 a barrel. Notes and bonds. 10 year note, up 7 ticks, 108.11, 30 year up 28 at 114.27 in King Dollar. King Dollar up 49 ticks, trading 105, 590. Euro 107, yen 151, British pound at 122 to one US dollar. So we go to uh, take a look at the SPY, folks. You're, just, you're building costs for higher price. That's the bottom line. You know, there's no sellers out here. You're going sideways out here. You know, you're down 34 cents, but the bottom line, you get a sideways move. We go into the, let's go in the note and bond market first, okay, because this is what you have out here. So the note market is going to need more volume. You know, we're up seven ticks right now on the 10. You know, this has been on a, a, a rampage as the S&P. We're at 4.519 right now, but you can see it's only 1.5 million contracts. So the bottom line is that in order to basically break the, the highs that are out here, you're going to have to bang out. Now, when we went up there, give me that, there we go. When we went up there, we pushed with 2.8 million, and that, that broke the swing point. So we're going to be back up there. It's just building cars, and it needs more volume. Now, we go to the gold contract. It's just the opposite. What you have with the gold contract, the gold contract right now is pulling down the 19 bucks, 1970. You can see there's 1.6 million contracts. Well, the 1.6 million, folks, is going against 2.7. So there's plenty of support here, man, you know. Bottom line, you're at the lower end of the range, you know, trading out here. And yeah, you might go a little bit lower, but the bottom line, you're, you're coming into some huge um, contract volume. And I suspect this is just a normal, yeah, we haven't done, done a 0 0.382 retracement yet. A 0 0.382 is at uh, the 1945 level. And then if we go over to King Dollar, and this is the big one here, King Dollar. Today, again, why? Because we failed on price again. So... This market's going to have a chance to run tomorrow and the next day. You can see this up here. We, we got to 105.872. We're at 105.603. And it's trying to get in the higher range again. It failed yesterday, and it's right at the line today. So it looks to me that this dollar is just failing, period. And bonds, they still want higher price. So right there, folks, we'll come right back. Sharpening your 